What's up guys? I'm Roxette Arisa and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm super excited. We're gonna be swatching the new Kim Kardashian West and Kylie Cosmetics collab. Um, can we just take a moment for that teaser that they put out? Okay, okay Kylie Cosmetics, we see you from outer space. So I was really excited as you can tell from um, just that little teaser and when they were launching this I was like yep I'm gonna need to get my hands on a set. So I decided to make a little swatch video for you guys in case you're wondering what the shades look like. They are all nudes because you know Kim Kardashian is pretty well known for always wearing nudes. Um, so or, yeah, but one cool thing. It's actually a new um, Formula, so this is cream liquid lipsticks not the like matte liquid lipsticks or what comes in her lip kits So new formula new collab new shades, so I'm pretty excited Tell me you are too and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into this video The first shade I'm swatching is the lightest shade of the collection and it's the shade Kimberly. This is Ooh, I love this type of nude because it has almost like a pale pink undertone to it and the formula was opaque on the first swipe which I was very impressed with. It didn't actually dry down. Um, this is a new formula like I mentioned so it's the cream liquid lipstick. I don't know why but I thought it did dry down a little bit more than this even but I would say that this is almost like a mixture between a gloss and a lipstick. Almost like a very very highly pigmented gloss gloss. Now let's move on to the second shade. The second shade is called Kim and this one has a bit more of a peachy undertone which to be honest with you guys I don't normally gravitate towards these sort of like bright peachy shades. That's just not really my jam but that being said it is still a nice color like I would still um, kind of contemplate wearing this you know what I mean if I was trying to change up my look or just trying to like change up the vibe of a look um, I think this is so definitely still something that I would reach for and again the formula is very nice it was very opaque on the first swipe and kind of playing off of what I was saying before it does not dry down so it's not feeling drying at all it's very very creamy and very glossy this next shade is Kiki it is is what I would call a true classic pink. It's not too bright, it's not too light, it's not too dull. It's just that classic pink that everyone loves and I feel like this is very suitable for a really big range of skin tones. Now this one, the formula was a little bit she more sheer than the other two shades that I had previously tried so I did notice a little bit of variance in the formula but honestly it wasn't horrible. Like it wasn't like out of this world crazy. It was just a little bit more sheer. And finally we've got Kimmy. Now Kimmy is what I would describe as kind of like a muted coral pink. It is the darkest shade in the set and honestly I think this is actually a very unique shade. I don't have many shades like this um, because of that muted coral undertone. It definitely has a lot of warmth so I think this is going to be a really pretty shade for the summertime. Alrighty so those are the swatches of the four shades that come in the collection. I'm actually really impressed with the collection. I think it's very cohesive with each other. Um, I really love the formula. I'll be honest with you guys. It's very similar to like the Marc Jacobs um, liquid lipstick sort of things. Like it's a cream. It's not going to dry down. It doesn't ever feel uncomfortable. It definitely doesn't have like the same properties as a matte liquid lipstick in that it's not going to be, um, you know, completely transfer proof or I don't know. You, you feel what I'm trying to say? It's not going to stay on as long because of the formula, but I think it's such a beautiful, beautiful formula, and I do like that it feels comfortable on the lips. And as far as the, um, I guess, the formula of each individual lip stick. I definitely think that these three are bomb.com and then the third one was a little bit more sheer but still very workable so there wasn't like one that was just horrible if that makes sense. They were all pretty solid. I'm actually really interested to hear what you guys thought of the shades and yeah comment down below what shade you like best or what which one's your favorite because for me one hundos this one like no doubt about it in my mind but they're all really beautiful so I'd be interested to hear your guys' thoughts. So yeah, that's gonna be it for me. Remember, you are beautiful and so ah! I am so tongue-tied all of a sudden. But remember, you are beautiful and sudden out. I love you guys, and I will see you next time.